rocking on the D, my homie rocks on the keys. He brings the people to their knees from Oxnard. He brings all the boys to the to the yard. Hey yo, my homie's got a yellow head thing. Hey yo, my homie's got a up back head thing. Vamos a ver si me sale algo de mi boca Vamos a ver qué es lo que me toca Qué es lo que traigo en mi mente para ustedes Qué es lo que voy a romper si esos pedos Mira que traigo un mensaje para ti No te voy a dar un mensaje positivo Porque no importa lo que tienes, tú vienes conmigo Tú estás en mi equipo, yo soy en tu equipo Somos una familia y vamos a parar Uh, so it's time for me to pass the mic. What? I love what you do. I love what you do. Y'all rocking it old school. Music. Music. Now check this out. You don't know me and I don't know you. But I rock it old school. I wrote a rhyme, something like this. This DJ, he gets down, mixing records while they go around with the hibbit, the hop, you just don't stop, the rock to the beat to the mix you drop. So, now, in this rhyme called Super Rhymes, I wrote a part about, about it being cool to be Dracula and say a rap. You know what I mean? So he said, now this DJ, now this DJ, I don't hear you. Gotta rock, gotta rock. He gets down. He gets down. He gets down. Now this DJ, not this vampire. The disco beat was his desire. Transylvania's where he made home. Until one day he decided to roam. And then out of the crib, a heated crawl. A Tom Dracula is what he's called. He said, the sun's on down, now it's not. Spread my wings and take a serious flight. I turned into a bat, I flew away. I said that the disco is where I gotta stay because by a cold, there's nothing like this. In Transylvania, this is what I miss. We just fight nuts and suck blood all day, and I knew there had to be a better way. So I packed my coffins and vampires and leaving. I turned into a bat and cut out that eat. At the disco I went, was 54. They wouldn't think me that man in the door. I said, listen, my man, I'm a real cool guy. I can turn into a bat. I can even fly. He said, Jackie Love, you could do all of that. Then come on in. They catch a needle freak attack and sit out of the crib. A heated call. A count Dracula is what he's called. Yeah. Yeah. And I wrote that years ago. Hit the dance floor like you get it paid for it. Hit the dance floor like it's your 
Gerald McCauley, and I'm a music producer, a veteran in the music business, a musician, and uh, I had the pleasure of recording uh, a concert DVD at Oxnard Performing Arts Center uh, that came out in 2004, and uh, members of my family are residents here in Oxnard. And uh, we look forward to bringing Rhodes Fest to the Oxnard College Performing Arts Center uh, because it brings a distinctive quality and level of music to this city. And music connects us all. Um, can you tell me a little bit about um, how people can get in touch with you? Uh, do you have a website? The most recent project that I've been involved in is the history of the Fender Rhodes electric piano and it's called Down the Roads, the Fender Rhodes Story. And you can get in touch, visit our website at www.fenderroadsstory.com and Rhodes is spelled R-H-O-D-E-S. So that's fenderroadsstory.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel and just check us out it's a it's a unique American history and we're proud to be the purve the purveyors of that history do you have any shout outs? oh man shout out to everybody who loves music yeah thank you Cool. Hey, what's up? My name's Daniel from Las Cafeteras. Uh, we're based in LA. We're like a seven member urban folk band. Uh, yeah, so, you know, we play roots music that we remix with acoustic instruments. We take uh, Afro Mexican music, like Son Jarocho, and we mix it with hip hop and cumbia and ska, Native American stuff. So we're like the new school with the old school. Um, and uh, we all met in Los Angeles, um, basically trying to figure out how to build a better city and how to make music together. And we kind of became a band, evolved into a being a band. And now we play all over the country. We played. Uh, with Juanes and Edward Sharp and the Magnetic Zeros, and uh, we've been friends with Maku Sound System for a long time, so it was cool when uh, Ileana uh, invited me up to like spit a few bars and just you know hang out. I think that's what's beautiful is that music brings us all together, you know. Um. I first got into music when I was uh, maybe I was probably in in fifth grade, uh, and I was at church, and in the youth room, but early, and they had some congas there. They were unattended, so I snuck into the youth room and I started banging on the congas, and then somebody walked in. I was all embarrassed. I was like, I. I'm, am I in trouble? And they're like, nah, man, that sounds good. So um, they told me I should play with the church youth band. So I started playing congas with the youth band, and that's how I started getting into music. Yeah, man.
Sure. Next up, we're uh, Las Cafeteras is playing um, a whole summer tour across the U.S. And then in the fall, uh, we'll be playing um, throughout the U.S. and Canada uh, from like uh, L.A. to New York, to Toronto and back. So uh, if you live in the U.S. or Canada, look out for Las Cafeteras. We're coming your way soon. Uh, I mean, I would say I'm an up-and-coming musician, you know, so uh, for all of my peers out there, anybody who, who's out there uh, trying to build their craft and, and prove themselves and also, um, you know, maybe uh, get resources to support them, um, I would say it's about practice, 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 and it's about uh, business, business, business. It's about uh, at least three times a week your band should be posting something on their social media. It's about finding a team and, and really making sure you build good relationships with um, with your peers, with your bands, with the bookers, with bars, with clubs, and really, um, I think, building uh, deep and genuine relationships. Uh, it's not just about business, it's about, you know, we're here for a short time on the surf, so let's um, also build good relationships. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you can find uh, my band Las Cafeteras online. Go to lascafeteras.com or just at Las Cafeteras on all the socials. So, yeah, we'll see you on Instagram. Peace. Hey, we're just uh, our Star Music and Art Series. This is the first of a, of a whole series we're going to do throughout the year. Uh, multicultural relationships, world music, we're going to bring artists from like UCSB residency program. We actually have Gerald McCauley here in the audience tonight, who's a Hollywood musician, keyboardist, knows everybody from like Alicia Keys, Stevie Wonder, you name it. Uh, we're going to be doing it here every month, once a month. Come on out. Don't forget it. We're here to promote the Cafe on A, arts, music, community organizations, videographers, film, projects, hip hop coalition. It's going to be great. Please come and support us. Thank you. Thank you, Jim.